All right, all right. You got Robin Lynn keeping the vibes live. And guess who is here with me right now? I'm about to drop my headphones. Mono Baggins is here. Mono Baggins is here. Mono, ba- Mono Baggins, are you here? I'm here, Robin. What up, what up, what up? How are you doing? Let me turn the music down a little bit so that we can we can hear your voice really good today. Yeah, what are you up to? It is a beautiful day. It is a beautiful day. Oh, what? No. What, 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 what are you up to? Hold on. This whole thing is just going just crazy on me. Here we go. <laughs> so, what you got, <laughs> so what have you been up to? What are you doing? Are you getting sexy for me? Are you going to get sexy for me? <laughs> are you? Will you? Well, yeah, do that for me. Any, any, anytime you want, Robin. No problem. <laughs> I'll be my magic mic. Yeah. This is so awesome. So, you've got some wonderful and awesome things going on. Uh, 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 I just did. Can you help me? Tell me where to start. You're so wonderful. Where do I start? At the head or at the toe? <laughs> I don't know. I'm like, when I look in the mirror, I'm pretty impressed with myself. It's hard for me to really get past my eyes, but, you know, I, I do try. Oh, okay. All right. Well, well, <laughs> my. Come closer. Let me see. Don't blink. <laughs> That's what all those, all those website pictures are for, you know, the people can get a good feel for my own physical appearance to match my, you know, ever-present sexy voice, it just all works out well. Mm-hmm, 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 yeah, well, you know, I tell you what, I tell you what, I, normally I'm kind of cool, and I'm a, I'm a God-fearing Christian woman, but you get a little close to me, I don't know, you, you might get God, you might get God, because you, you know, you, you're not bad. You're not bad, Mono. You're not bad. (laughs) Uh, I personally think not bad is an understatement, but I'll take that. (laughs) Man, you rock. You rock. So, um, just tell us some, well, tell us some wonderful things about about you. Tell us who you are. Tell us about some of your music, your latest and greatest. Can you do that? Oh, no problem for y'all who don't know I am. My name is Mono Baggins. I'm from Brooklyn, New York. I'm the CEO of Baggins Records. Uh, we just dropped a new single called uh, Get Sexy For Me. It's first coming out now. Uh, before that, my uh, last single, On Fire, pretty much uh, got rotation all over the world. It was on MTV in Latin America. Mm-hmm. I think the video now has something like a half a million hits on uh, YouTube. So, you know, we got a, a lot of good things popping off all around. Mm-hmm, yeah. It's got about a thousand hits on Vibes Live, I know, because I played it all a thousand times. <laughs> oh, no doubt. Thank you. I appreciate that. Oh. I definitely appreciate that. You like the On Fire record, Robin? I do, but I kind of like all everything that you do, Mono. I just, I think I like you, Mono. <laughs> well, I am a likable guy, you know, I can't really know. <laughs> we, we are who we are in life, you know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, uh, 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 why don't we do this? Why don't we go ahead and listen to On Fire, and then I'd like to come back and talk to you uh, uh, some more and ask some more questions. Uh, uh, I think you know some friends of mine, and I'd like to, uh, I want to talk about them behind their back, okay? <laughs> That's cool, no problem. I'll, I'll enjoy it. Anything I say to them, I'll say to their face, though, too, so it'll be a cool conversation. Well, they're not here. I mean, I could invite them. You want me to Skype them? <laughs> and then we could do them on. No, I'm just kidding you. But you, listen, everyone, we've I don't got. Know. Depends on who you're bringing on. Well, well, you know, we'll we'll discuss it. We'll talk amongst ourselves after this song. We're going to listen to Mono Baggins on. <laughs> no doubt. I am so excited. No, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Yeah. Mm-mm-mm-mm. And that's you know what? Who does your hair? Where do you get your hair done, Mono? <laughs> uh, in my own bathroom. Are you serious? Man, you know what? Yeah. Get yeah. out of the way. Yeah. Three seconds to do. Yeah. And nothing can stop me now. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Get out of the way. Since now you 
see that I'm just on my grind to rip these beats apart. I'm gonna make sure that this world is mine. My time to shine and burn it down. I'm lava hot and blistering. I'm torn red hot, boiling, scorching, torches sizzling. You listening? I'm humbling humanity for human sake. Humiliating, humanize. I captivate and cultivate. Concentrate to commentate, communicate and correlate. You crucify and testify and celebrate, congratulate. Calibrate, don't hesitate. I really just annihilate. I massacre and mutilate. I'm really trying to motivate. Sober games from over, I levitate, I'm flying high, got more in store, fuel supply, I liberate and free your mind, and irritate a yellow spine, I'll demand a man for you to get up, it's about my time. Yeah. Yeah. Anticipate a bad day, a mad man, he don't play Hey, I really think that you just simply really feeling me I know that I'm the best and all you other cats are hearing me You cheering me, you toasting me I'm flowing C, I'm flying B, I'm sky and G Over the top of sky, scraping dynasty You fly as me, honestly You really think you eyeing me You really can't compete with me You really shouldn't speak to me Cheer the chatter, pay the fattest Feel this bladder, right the dust I cuss and bust, what's the fuss? Just shut up, it's time for hush Everything about my style, I know my fans are I see you on my Facebook and my Twitter You were typing it, you notice me I'm chosen, see I'm boasting B I'm blowing G, everything about me Ferociously and don't see Exaggerate, you take your time and waste your mind. I rhyme, I don't procrastinate. Rejuvenate, regenerate, recuperate, retaliate. You really think you would beat me? Defeat me, reevaluate. Can't be stopped, my venom got my swagger just to swipe the ring. You know, cats trying to stop me, man. I'm sorry, there's no help in it. Smoke, that's you. Put yourself out. <laughs> um, um, now, you got, we've got, we've got, uh, uh, I, I, I see you doing some things over there. I, I, I first found out about you over there on the Giant Blast. And I would like to give a shout out to mm -hmm. the folks over there at Giant Blast. Would you? <laughs> yeah, of course. I always want to give a shout out to my man Jay. Jay is a real good dude, man. He does all his business the right way and stuff. Uh, you know, I've dealt with him for a long time. He's one of those cats who goes above and beyond for his clients. He, uh, you know, he's just a real good old dude overall. He, uh, good people. Uh, like I said, he does his business the right way. I definitely recommend, you know, any independent artists out there who mm -hmm. are trying to get their music out to deal with him. He does everything the fair way. Mm -hmm. He goes above and beyond for his clients when he's really feeling the music. I, I, I can only say good things about him. Yeah, yeah. Me, me too. He, uh, I'm a big fan of the Giant Blast. Big, big fan of some guy named Jay. Just just big, big. And, and since uh, uh, Vibes Live has run across them, we've a lot of uh, interviews and a lot of people that the Giant Blast have worked with 
have been gracious enough to come on and hang out with this nice little old lady hanging out here sitting at home minding her own business not bothering nobody not bothering nobody mano i promise <laughs> I believe you. I believe you. You, say, you sound a little wild over there, but I believe you. I sound what? No, no, mono, mono. I am a good Christian, God-fearing woman. I am. <laughs> I really you can, am. You can be all that and be a little wild too. It's you know. Listen, I listen. I'm I'm trying to be cool, mono. They don't. The people they don't always they, they don't always know how to take me. Now you're not helping. I thought. I thought you uh, were my friend, Mono. Now my feelings are going to, they're getting hurt. Now, I might have to do something. Now, since, since ever since that I found out you, that you were coming over here, okay, and, and, and you had this, this request by way of a song called uh, Get Sexy, Get Sexy For Me. Now, Mono. Get Sexy For Me. Yeah, I done, I done curled my hair, Mono. Uh, I done got, went out and got my, my nails did, okay. I didn't have the kids wash the car. We done mowed the lawn, trimmed the trees. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And so... All, all in honor of Get Sexy for me? Well, yeah. It's a special occasion. <laughs> I, you know, I, I'm really feeling that right now. I could say that you're the first person to tell me that, but I'd be lying. So, you know, I just, I can't say it. Well, but, I thank you. Know, you. I, I thank you for, for not lying. And I'm so glad to hear that you're getting all the love because you sure deserve it. You really do. Now, so I know that you have to become quite accustomed to when you just when you just walk in a room that all the women they just get skinless and maybe some men too. Does that happen to you? I hope not. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know it happens on the regular. You know it, it's hard sometimes. You know I just focus on you know looking at myself because I feel like I'm the most attractive person in the room. So no matter how attractive the women are, they're getting undressed to me. I, I just don't focus on myself. You know it's called a narcissism. You know, I, I I can I can relate because every time I look in the mirror, I mean, I even go to comb my hair, and I'm like, it's no need. You know, it is. It's like hard for me to even leave the house in the morning. I'm like, well, why am I gonna go out and just you know look at other people? So I might as well just sit here and you know. Just you know what? Put yourself. This is what you do. You just sit on top of the TV. Don't even turn it on. You sit on top of the TV and watch yourself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I bet that'll really mess up the deals. So listen, let's listen to Get Sexy for me. Can we do that? <laughs> I would love to listen to Get Sexy for me right there. Yeah, yeah. Get Sexy for me. Oh, man. I'm going to get up and start doing the Dougie. Man, you know, that's what you're going to do, the Dougie? I do my magic mic for the long way. I love the way you lift your lips. I love the way you move your body. Yeah, baby, you a hottie. Show me what you got, girl. Try to look, go slow. Every inch that body, girl. Wanna know, pop, go, head low. Glad to meet you. Now I'll freak you. Then I'll teach you. Yo, eyes hypnotize and mesmerize you. Beautified. Everything about you, girl. I'm eyeing you from head to toe. Let's just leave your reason. Play a game called stripping show. I know you're feeling me. See, I know I'm feeling you. Go, anything we gonna do. I'm in between me and you. I wanna feel your touch and I wanna feel your love. So imagine what will happen when our bodies start to stack it.
lips if you sexy and you know it lick them lips lick them lips if you sexy and you know it drop it low drop it low if you sexy and you know it let it show let it show You know what, mono, 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 mono. Pass me some milk and cookies and some water and some, I don't know, some chocolates. I need some champagne. I don't know. You just, can I ask you a question? Now, this might be personal, but I really, I really. You need I, some butterscotch with that. Yeah, but I have a question. We, we sure. all, I would really like to know. I really must know. Who told you to be so cute? Who told you? Who told you? Some? Uh, Oh, I just, I love it, man. You are great. That's, you, you, that's what it was. It was just, you know, I, you know, it, it, it just, it, sometimes you're just born with things, you know? Yeah. And you know what? You, no, you, no, you are, you know, we're laughing and things like that, but, um, um, you know, you do have, you do have greatness. You, you got, you, your music is really, really awesome. You know, it, it, it really, really is. And that, that is a gift, and our gifts do come from God, but, you know, it's just so awesome. Um, I would like to know how, how the music, has it, how has it impacted your life? Like, uh, oh, I'm probably well, sure it's been uh, great. Know, first off, I just want to say thank you very much for the compliments with the music. I really appreciate yeah. it. Uh, you know, I work very hard on it. The music is just my passion for life and stuff. Mm -hmm. Anytime I'm doing something... When I start, uh, I could be in a, a foul mood, and then I'll just, you know, go in my office, and once I start writing and rapping, just, you know, I get that uh, that peace all over my whole body. So it just, you know, lets me know that that's what God wants me doing. Mm -hmm. uh, it just is it's my happiness. It's my happy spot. It doesn't matter uh, what's going on. As long as I'm doing that, I'm good. Yeah, yeah. And you, we know you work hard. Uh, one thing I'm finding that some of the artists they really don't they don't get is that you have to work equally hard on getting yourself out there the promotion you know and so I, I'll see some artists in there they're getting their grind on and they're in the studio all the time but you talk to them you, or you give them opportunities to come on from promo and they're like well no you know I'm not I'm not done the studio yet and uh, and and I think the successful artists that I've seen, they're in like all kind of different progressions. They may be on a video on, on, on a song or on a track on this album and already writing for the next two or three albums. You know what I'm saying? There's always a progression. And so uh, what do you do? Like once you've done the, this album, what do you do? Do you have a bevy of songs written or are you just ready to move on to the next? It's so fascinating to me, the whole process. Yeah, I mean, I have. I don't even know how many songs, 40, 50 songs done. I mean, it's just, I have a plethora of songs from, you know, I've been doing this for a long time and stuff. Running out songs is, is never a problem, but mm -hmm. you're 100% you're right. A promotion marketing standpoint is very difficult for a lot of artists, uh, you know, financially and uh, just getting the right team. It's all about having a good team around you, having a trustworthy team. Uh, it takes a long time, you know, I'm a firm believer that when something's supposed to happen, God puts the right people on your path, and you know, it's not on our time, it's on His time, and you know, when when He opens that door, no man can close it, so you just gotta just keep doing your part, and uh, He'll do the rest, but you know, you're 100% right that there's a lot of talented artists out there who, you know, never get their shine because they don't have the connections, they don't know how to promo, they don't know how to market, uh, you know, 
Mm -hmm. It is a grind. The music business is a very, very difficult business for anyone who's thinking about getting involved in it. But if it's your passion and that's what you know gives you your peace, mm -hmm. go for it. Yeah, go for it. Really, really. So, um, where can we find your music and how can we find you? I mean, Twitter, you know, Google, stuff like that. Yeah, I mean, that, that's the bait. I mean, Twitter, Facebook, Google, all that stuff. Uh, we have my own website, uh, bagendsblogspot.com. Uh, bagendsblog.blogspot.com. Probably the easier way to find it than me spelling that out is just go on Google and type in Mono Baggins. For y'all don't know, it's M-O-N-O-B-A-G-E-N-D-S. It's two words. Mm -hmm. uh, the On Fire record is on sale now on... Uh, iTunes, Amazon, and everywhere else online. Music of Soul, Get Sexy. We haven't officially released yet, but that's going to be coming soon. There's so many great songs I have, you know, lined up to just be following it, and we're going to hit you with track after track now. Uh, you know, sometimes uh, due to the personal things, I wind up taking a break from the music, but not right now. Now we're just going full speed ahead because it seems like, you know, now's the right time. And, you know, everything is all systems go. Yeah, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Are there any shout outs or is there anything that you'd like to say or acknowledge anyone or just tell us some more about your wonderful self? Yeah, well, thank you very much, you know, Robin, for the interview. I appreciate it. Actually, I want to give a shout out to my man, Jay, the Giant Blast, obviously. I want to give a shout out to my man, Filthy Rich, who's my engineer. He's been with me for a long time and through all my insanity and madness, he's always stuck with me no matter. Uh, how crazy I've gotten. So he's been there from studio to studio to support me. Uh, you know, I'll just give a shout out to all my fans out there who, you know, are buying the music and listening to the music and checking it out. I definitely appreciate it. Uh, for people who you want to know more about me, there's a multitude of interviews all over the internet, uh, not just specifically on my music, but lifestyle interviews, so you can find out more about me as a person. I'm just a, a God-fearing person who's just going to work hard in life and uh, get through my trials and tribulations and live my life to the fullest. Mm. Well, I'm really glad that you took the time to come in here today. You just made my day, and you've been making my day since I since you've been telling us to get sexy for you. Now, me myself, <laughs> I will not be doing that because I am a God-fearing Christian woman. Now, I have to maintain some modem of decorum over here. <laughs> You what you could do, Rob, you could play the record all day and all night this way for the people who want to get sexy with it. You know, they can have a whole plethora of it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, a whole plethora. And so, you know what? I am actually going to play it. I might, I'm going to play it now, and I might play it like six more times before I'm done. <laughs> That's usually just like, keep, it should be like just the Get Sexy for Me hour. And then you could throw On Fire on there, and it just be a beautiful, beautiful. I'm just going to let it run 24 hours, and I'm going to lo load it up on I, my server, too, on the autoplay. Yep, and I'm going to share it, too. I'm going to put it on the Twitter. I'm going to put it on the Twitter for you, yeah. It's been, it's been really, really great it. talking to you today. I am so glad to meet you. I hope that you'll come back. Oh, wait a minute. One more thing. I saw somewhere something yeah. about you and something about Saturday Night Live. Are you going to be on Saturday Night Live, or do they want you to? Are there some buzz going on around that? I almost forgot. Yeah, there, there was some rumors to that. That was something that uh, that Jay had hooked up. Uh, I don't know the specifics of any of that yet that I could speak on, but yeah, there, there's some rumors going around. Really? Wow. Well, you know, when you get there, you just have to let them know that once that now that Mono Baggins is there, that they are rolling with the big dog, and they need to behave. And if you have any problems, Mono, you just call me. You got the number. You just call me, and I will rough them up on your behalf. I certainly will. I don't mind. <laughs> okay, I'm always looking for murderers on the payroll. No <laughs> Murder, what the case that they gave me. All right. Hey, oh, wait a minute. But I just need to make sure. Now, I don't need any stipends or anything like that. However, if I do get arrested, you got my bail money, right? And you're going to put some money on my books. Well, I got to go. <laughs> oh, yeah, I got to go to terms. Don't worry about it. We got you. <laughs> 
Yeah. All yeah, right. I, if I don't know a guy, I know a guy who knows a guy. Okay. All right. So your people will call my people, and I'll be straight. Boy, I wonder how long it'll take to get down to my books, though. Okay, listen, Mono Baggins, everyone. Thank you so much for coming. It is just wonderful to meet you. And come back, okay? I definitely will. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, Ron. All right. See you later. Mono Baggins, everyone. Man, that's awesome. Thank you. Hehehehe. <laughs>